All right, so I am doing a new video now. Um, unfortunately, got a new job. Had to leave the old house with the uh, the hidden bookshelf that I spent a long time building. But um, now I'm trying to figure out, um, you know, best place to put uh, both um, anything that's valuable as well as keep the uh, guns and rifles away from the kids. Um, and so what I'm doing is I'm taking our one of our hall closets closets and turning that basically into a gun closet um, with a deadbolt so that the kids can't come in and then we'll, we'll most likely put a safe in here as well. Um, so what I did is, um, you know, my wife didn't want an obvious kind of uh, obnoxious um, uh, deadbolt or anything on a hallway closet. And so what I what I did is I put a, um, a, a basically a hidden deadbolt from a company called Seco Alarm, and here's the, the model that we put in, um, and then hooked that up to a digital keypad in, a, uh, in an adjacent closet. And so what, you'll, what you have basically is we'll have a, uh, basically a hall closet in here, which is where, where we are going to store um, our firearms. And then what you can see is, you know, instead of doing this, uh, I, I didn't tape it early enough, but basically here is the, uh, the deadbolt that is going in, and it goes into the, um, the frame of the side. And what happens is um, I took the, um, oh, let me, t so I, I took the, um, uh, this off, and of course that leaves a small gap that you can see on the side. And then basically what I've done is uh, screwed this out, uh, screwed a hole through there, and then screwed a hole in this way so that the wire, the wires from here run up through the back of here and then down um, through the floor. Luckily, we have a crawl space under there, under the house, and so uh, that can go in the crawl space and then up and over. And so then what we have is we have that coming down over, and then there's adjacent closet here, and we have that coming up um, to this, uh, this keypad, which is a, a, a typical keypad. Um, had to run the wires up through the, through here. Luckily, we had our alarm system, which had, there's a big hole uh, behind this. So I basically had to pull this off, run the wire up through here, and then as you, you'll see the wires that are coming down here, they're all connected inside here, and then we have a power supply. Um, and so the, the way this works is, and, and I think it's pretty neat, is um, there's a magnet here. Um, so here's the, the deadbolt. There's a magnet which activates uh, the deadbolt. And so what happens is when you shut this, there's a delay, and then it locks. And as you can see, it's not pulling out. And so if you were to look at this closet while it was locked, you know, what we didn't want is some obnoxious keypad or something here uh, showing that it was, um, or it was built into something that was different than just a normal, um, uh, a, a normal closet. And then so you go over here, enter here, and I'm not gonna show you the, basically unloading it, it then come over here, it opens the deadbolt, pull it open, and then this stays open. As long as this little magnet here doesn't come across, the way this works is once this once the magnet moves over here, that activates the solenoid in here, which pulls out the deadbolt. And so again, you know, I, need, I need to add some little touch-up paint as well, because as I was chipping that out, but closing it, deadbolt goes. And you can, you can actually set the delay on that. You could set it to two seconds, I have it at five, you could put it at 30 seconds as well, but um, I mean, I, I really like the way that looks. Uh, and in fact, you can't tell. And, and basically, this was not meant to stop burglaries or anything along those lines. This really was meant to, you know, keep, for anything that we want to keep the kids out of, um, we can keep the kids out of here. So, hope you enjoyed that. And for anyone else looking to build something in your closet, um, this is the way. Now, in terms of what um, what we're trying to do here. Um, I'm not done yet, but, um, you know, we think we're going to have a safe at the back here. Um, and then I'm looking to put, um, some gun racks here to put long, uh, to be able to put long rifles. Um, and then here we'll probably store ammo and maybe some handguns. Uh, we'll, we'll have to see, but, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Take care.